Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. We are here at Home Depot for our first lumber trip, which is pretty exciting. Um, so on top for this weekend with the van, we are going to uh, weld some pieces of sheet metal to those rust spots that went through the van. Um, and we're gonna enforce that with some caulking. And uh, then we're getting some lumber so we can frame out the floor for the insulation we just got some sound deadener and we've gotten a couple other things uh to get the van started we're using some styrofoam to insulate the floor of the van so that's everything that i think we're gonna try and accomplish this weekend so stay tuned see a little bit more progress on the van bye Cause I don't know how to back down, how to back down No, I don't know how to back down, how to back down Careful I'm a lion, don't test my pride Standing like a mountain, making the devil ride in his eyes Got no fears Only got my blood, my sweat, and my tears All right, so uh, we got everything clean and all that going down the van. So now all we did um, we sprayed a bit of some primer here on the spots that had the paint removed. Um, and after that, we're just gonna spray the, we're gonna do two coats of paint on the, uh, just on the floor um, of the van to seal it. Obviously we scraped off most of the rust and all that, but we wanna starve that rust uh, that we didn't get so it doesn't spread too quick, too fast, or at all. Um, so we're just, you know, we have a bunch of leftover paint um, from, I don't know, this is all been left over, uh, found in the garage. So we're gonna be working on that. And then all the seams, we are going to spray with this leak seal that we also found in the garage. Uh, and then around the welds, because we just spot welded it all, we are going to use caulking. Also in the holes, um, that we're put in the van, we're gonna caulk them, and then when we put the sound deadener over there, that should seal it. And then I'll get un underneath and spray some of this asphalt undercoating to seal it from that side. So we found a colony of baby spiders. So Garrick is currently taking uh, some good old insecticides and. Letting those little guys die. Spider van, spider van. We're not calling it spider van. Does whatever spider van does. Can it swing from a web? No, it can't because it's a van. <laughs> oh, it's a spider van. That should kill all of them. Just assume. Done and dusted.
Oh, why, hello there. Okay, so now we are putting on the sound deadener. Uh, we got 50 mil kill mat that we got on Amazon. We will put the link in it below, um, or link to it below. Go check it out. We're just gonna do on all these panels, just to reduce the rattling. Um, the guy that had this before sealed all this. Um, like this is aftermarket stuff, which also really helps with the rattling. Um, so yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. What's up guys, it's another weekend and we are back here. Um, I'm sure you saw the first half of the video, what we did last weekend and what I did during the week when Morgan was gone. Uh, well, I put in the framing in the floor, glued it down um, with some adhesive, some construction adhesive, and then I put the um, sound deadener on the floor and on the wheel wells. Um, I know it's a little redundant put it on the floor because that's the, the whole point of the floor being um, built how it is um, to absorb some of that, but nonetheless, just to add a bit more sound ending properties. Um, obviously, it's going to be good with the insulation as well, but we figured, you know, we might as well do it right if we're going to do it. So now it's down to the insulation. All right, so we finished up the, the insulation on the floor here. Um, many people are probably wondering why didn't we do more for insulation for um, the floor? Well, it's simple because heat rises. Um, there's not much that you can do uh, to the floor that's really that useful. It seems to be kind of redundant the more you do. Um, so we kind of just went with the simple Duraform here. And then we're gonna foil tape it, and that should give it a good little vapor barrier, barrier, vapor barrier. Um, and that's kind of all that we're at right now. All right, so, well, we just trimmed the first piece of plywood. Whee! Skill saw there. Uh, we use the old floor to trace the wheel wells, and that's basically where we're at right now. So I'm gonna cut it. Jigsaw. Um, yeah, we'll see. Replace the blade, new blade. So. We're in full spaceship mode now.
There it is. Floor is in. Now we gotta screw it down. guys that's it for uh this van series number two build we hope you guys enjoyed it and we'll keep you up to date with everything else we do next in the van yeah so i hope you guys like this comment down below let us know what you think of the build so far what we've done wrong what we can improve on and maybe what you want to see in the van yeah. you know just let us know hit up the comment section we're always looking for inspo yeah and we always reply right morgan yes yeah i mean <laughs> Two comments isn't hard, so. <laughs> um, it's another thing. I think, you know what? If we get 10,000 likes on this, we'll put a water slide on the van. Okay. So, yeah. 10,000 10, likes. 10, likes. <laughs> All right. And we just have one special announcement or shout special out. shout out, special goodbye today. Bye, Dad. Don't want you to feel left out. Please, your mom and me, Mm-hmm.